Alcohol kills New Mexicans at a higher rate than anywhere else in the country. In fact, that statistic hasn't changed since 1997. Diana Casillo joins us now this morning. Diana, excessive drinking causes more than just deaths in our state. That's right. Now, according to NMHealth.com, excessive alcohol use costs New Mexico more than $2 billion a year. That adds up to more than $1,000 per New Mexican each year. But let's go back to the numbers for a second. In 2020, alcohol killed more New Mexicans under 65 than COVID in the first year of the pandemic. More than 1,800 people, but excessive alcohol consumption doesn't just lead to death. The negative consequences also lead a long list of health issues, including chronic liver disease, high blood pressure, and even cancer. One in five people in New Mexico die every day from alcohol use. So it, it, it's a big thing that I don't think is being talked about enough. It's also important to talk about these negative consequences as well. Domestic violence, crime, poverty, and unemployment. Nationally, the most common reasons people who need and seek treatment don't receive it is because one, they don't have health insurance and can't afford the cost. But there are some people who simply may not know they have a problem. Are you drinking first thing in the morning, right? Are, are you having too many drinks when you go out tonight? Are you, do you feel hungover a lot more than normal? You know, those are really simple, simple telltale signs that you're drinking too much alcohol. And again, go to your primary care provider because they'll be able to talk to you about the different screening tests and questions that we as physicians ask all the time to our patients. If you or someone you know needs help fighting alcohol addiction, we will put resources on our website at KOB.com. In the newsroom, Diana Castillo, KOB4.